What do you think prompts Voyager 1 to dispatch enigmatic signals our way? None have ventured as far from Earth as NASA's Voyager 1, which is an intrepid explorer charting the cosmos for 45 years since its 1977 launch to delve into the mysteries of Jupiter and Saturn. This celestial detective probes the unexplored realms, a valiant emissary of the Voyager mission, sharing its cosmic insights for a duration surpassing all counterparts, now venturing beyond the solar system's limits. Yet in the spring of 2022, this seasoned traveler perplexed NASA engineers by transmitting signals that defied expectations, diverging from its decade-long journey beyond the heliosphere. But what triggered this anomalous behavior in the enduring probe, and what cosmic missive was it endeavoring to convey? Welcome to Spaceverse, your portal to the boundless wonders of the universe. From the mysteries of distant galaxies to the secrets of our own solar system, we're here to ignite your curiosity and spark your imagination. So without further ado, let's blast off into the cosmos. The narrative of NASA's Voyager 1 spacecraft is a poignant ode to the allure of inaugural space odysseys and the aspirations of faraway worlds that captivated the globe in the 1960s and 70s. The pursuit of unraveling the solar system's secrets stood as a paramount objective for the United States. Initiating in the late 1960s, the Discor spurfed a project, and by 1972, engineers unveiled the triaxial stabilized spacecraft, which is guided by an orientation control system relying on astronomical coordinates or a gyroscopic mechanism to align its high-gain antennas with Earth. The Command Computer Subsystem, or CCS, orchestrated sequencing and control, while the Attitude and Articulation Control Subsystem, or AACS, governed the spacecraft's orientation and antenna alignment. Communication occurred through S-band command transmissions at 16 bits per second, with X-band transmitters relaying telemetry at varying rates. The electricity source. Three radioisotope thermoelectric generators, or RDGs, which is generating around 149 watts. This intricate system marked a groundbreaking feat for deep space exploration. Dubbed Voyager in 1976, the twin spacecraft embarked on a five-year mission charged with the lofty goal of approaching Jupiter and Saturn, capturing and transmitting the essence of these celestial neighbors. Unable to return, Voyager 1 transformed into a cosmic messenger, and its cargo is none other than the Golden Record, a treasury of greetings in 55 languages, earthly visuals, and a musical anthology from Beethoven to Chuck Berry's Johnny B. Good. Intriguingly, both Voyager crafts set sail in the same year, with Voyager 1, the second to depart Earth, but is destined to arrive first at its designated haven. In adherence to its program, the spacecraft mere months into its cosmic sojourn sent forth the inaugural space portraits of Earth, and the Moon starts unveiling vistas never before beheld. In the celestial theater of 1979, as the spacecraft approached Jupiter, it unfurled a spectacle for scientific minds. The premiere of active volcanoes not on Earth, but on the Moon Io. Further enchantment awaited as the spacecraft unveiled two moons Phoebe and Metis, adorning the ring system like celestial jewels. And amidst Jupiter's atmospheric ballet, a celestial premiere unfolded. The spacecraft captured the maiden lightning bolt, a dance of electric luminosity. Upon reaching the Saturnian realm and the enigmatic moon Titan, Voyager 1's Odyssey revealed a trove of celestial treasures. Three moons named Atlas, Prometheus and Pandora also graced the cosmic tableau. The scrutiny of Titan's mysteries laid bare the revelation of an Earth-like atmosphere which is rich in nitrogen, where liquid methane and ethane could weave their existence. Having charted Saturn's secrets, Voyager 1 ascended, departing the plane of the planetary symphony, venturing beyond our solar sanctuary, which is 4 billion miles distant. The final act unfolded as the spacecraft in adherence to its mission's craft captured the cosmic portrait. A mesmerizing ensemble featuring Venus, Earth, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune encircling the solar sovereign. Our humble home, a pale blue dot suspended in a radiant beam, prompted contemplation on its delicate existence. And on a fateful day, Voyager 1's lens is closed, conserving its computational vigor. It relinquished the allure of proximity to celestial bodies for further exploration. A serendipitous chapter unfolded in the SARG of this intrepid mission, a testament to the spacecraft's unwavering fidelity. Beyond its stipulated five-year tenure, Voyager 1 persisted, narrating the cosmic chronicle from the deep expanse. 
In 1998 it eclipsed the record of Pioneer 10 becoming Earth's farthest emissary. And by 2004, Voyager 1 etched its name in cosmic annals as the inaugural traveler to breach the heliosphere, stepping into the vast tapestry of interstellar space. The heliopause crossing marked by a ballet of slowed particles, revealed the interplay of plasma and pressure, forging a path into realms less dense and temperate. As the heliosphere yielded to interstellar dominion, Voyager 1 weathered overwhelming forces, a cosmic crescendo marked by overloads and a resonating shockwave. And alas, the ground antennas stood silent, unable to grasp the data relayed during this celestial metamorphosis. Hence in 2012, the probe pierced the heliopause venturing where the solar's mantle met the distant particles from other cosmic beacons. And in the following April of 2013, Voyager 1 seized a celestial sonnet, a unique resonance born of a solar coronal mass ejection capturing the symphony of space's unseen harmonies. The undulating wave that reached out to touch the probe stirred the surroundings, imbuing them with an unfamiliar density divorced from the heliospheric norm nearly 40 times higher than previous measurements. The crescendo of a high-pitched signal emerged as the resounding anthem signifying the spacecraft's triumphant entry into a realm uncharted, beckoning NASA and humanity into a new cosmic sphere. Now in the subsequent chapters of its cosmic odyssey, Voyager 1 danced with solar tsunamis on multiple occasions, a celestial waltz that birthed data shaping new theories of the solar wind and unraveling the intricate dance between the heliosphere and the interstellar medium. The year 2017 witnessed a rekindling of vigor as the mission team reanimated the spacecraft's backup engines, which is a testament to their unwavering reliability even after a 37-year slumber. Also a climactic encore unfolded in 2021, with Voyager 1 baptizing itself in what NASA whimsically termed clean interstellar waters, conducting the inaugural symphony of material density measurements in the interstellar expanse. The celestial orchestra played on tuning into the rhythm of change, deciphered through the evolving frequencies of signals dispatched by the probe. The density of electrons emerged as the cosmic barometer, a crescendo translating into higher pitches and vice versa. A poetic interlude ensued as the mission team discerned an episodic diminuendo in signal tone, occasionally mirroring the cadence of Earth's atmospheric echoes. Yet, the dawn of early 2022 cast a perplexing shadow over this seasoned spacefarer. Inexplicably, it began to weave distorted telemetry data, a cosmic puzzle confounding the engineers. The probe, a diligent cosmic scribe, dutifully executed instructions, amassed and transmitted scientific marvels, yet the compass of its additive control and articulation system, or AACS, offered an unreliable narrative of its celestial ballet. The AACS, which is a guardian of Voyager 1's orientation toward Earth, continued its cosmic choreography, offering a stable signal, yet the transmitted data on the spacecraft's position seemed choreographed by celestial caprice. The engineers faced with a probe unwilling to embrace a safe-mode sanctuary, embarked on a celestial waiting game during the interlude of data exchange, a contemplative pause stretching over 20 hours. The life cycle of the equipment compelled NASA to don a philosophical mantle, confronting the cosmic enigma with an adaptable spirit. The press service veiled the duration of Voyager 1's location quandary but affirmed the engineers' readiness to pirouette into uncharted cosmic choreography. At this juncture in the mission, such enigmas are almost par for the course, elucidates Susan Dodd, the maestro behind Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 as the project manager at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Southern California. These two cosmic voyagers boast an age of nearly 45 years, surpassing the expectations of mission planners. Factor in the uncharted realms of interstellar space, a domain saturated with unprecedented radiation, and you've got a cosmic ballet unlike any before. But trust me, if there's a key to unlock the mystery within the AACS, our team will unearth it. The wayward celestial wanderer was reined in come August 2022, and the perpetrator behind the dissemination of faulty data was unmasked. The long dormant onboard computer roused from its cosmic slumber and re-established a connection to the message transmission chain, a factor overlooked by the team for an extended period. This dormant entity turned out to be the puppeteer behind the production of erroneous coordinates. Faced with this revelation, the engineers started embracing a calculated gamble which authorized the AACS team to command the resumption of data transmission to the correct operational computer. 
This orchestrated move reignited the flow of telemetry, and Voyager 1 gracefully reclaimed its celestial stance in the intricate choreography of NASA's spacecraft ballet. The puzzling question of why AAC has started dispatching location data to the wrong computer remains unanswered. It's a cosmic riddle that might have originated from an inaccurate directive emanating from another onboard entity. Should this hold true, the glitch resides elsewhere in the spacecraft. The detective quest continues, but the team reassures that it poses no lasting threat to Voyager 1's cosmic health. We're thrilled that Suzanne Dodd is set to embark on a comprehensive AACS memory odyssey delving into the depths of every nuance. This deep dive promises to illuminate the root cause of the telemetry conundrum, propelling us into further cosmic investigations. In the present day, Voyager 1 strides forth on its cosmic expedition, beaming back fresh insights into the mysteries of interstellar space. NASA foresees the vitality of its engines persisting until at least 2025. Each spacecraft slowly shedding about 4 watts of electrical power annually, setting constraints on the range of systems the generator can sustain. In a strategic dance to ease the burden, mission engineers have muted heaters prioritizing the cosmic quest. None of the scientific instruments face the guillotine due to diminished power. The probe diligently harvests data, employing its cosmic ray instrument, plasma instrument, magnetometer, and low-energy charged particle instrument. The Voyager team, which is the custodians of this cosmic wanderer, toils to ensure the spacecraft remains an intrepid collector of unique scientific narratives, traversing additional celestial miles before the celestial lull takes hold. And that's it. Thank you for joining us on another cosmic journey here at Spaceverse. If you've enjoyed our interstellar explorations, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our celestial adventures. Feel free to delve into our playlist for more mind-expanding content and share your thoughts or suggestions in the comments below. Remember, the universe is vast and so is the knowledge we're uncovering together. Until our next cosmic rendezvous, keep looking up, space explorers.